speaking of coming. J O N. Play me some pepper, man. Immediately, man. Play me some pepper. <laughs> the streets are in need of musical instruments, J O N. Bring me back. Oh, we're coming like we're coming like a journey or something. Oh, we in the rainforest, ain't we? Where that USDA? That's when white people get lost in the hood right there. <laughs> it's so tropical. I look good. I look what? You can just start throwing random shit on that place, right? Like, I come from the land down under. <laughs> <laughs> what? I come from the land down under. <laughs> What is going oh, yeah. on over here? I'm gonna talk to you. anything on this bitch. <laughs> Any of the white people. Bro. All of them white people so good. You sound Jamaican. Street dreams are made of of me. Who am I to disagree? I travel the world in the seven seas. Everybody. Looking for something. <laughs> Want to use you? Some of them won't be you. Yup. I know that's right. Hey, some of them want to be misused. Mm -hmm. Especially niggas, right. the older ones. What do you mean? She ain't wrong, probably. No, she, older guys. They, they want you to break the back. Beat their motherfucking ass. And, and mm -hmm. kick them in the nuts. Yup. What? <laughs> mm -hmm. Put them shoes on, I bought you. <laughs> come here and stomp my nuts. What? What? He gets nah. to come here and stomp my nuts. Like, what? <laughs> Stand on my nuts. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. This is crazy. Stand on my nuts. Stand on my nuts. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my gosh. What? Yeah. Yeah. You oh. running up. I didn't. He said it, and you I said, said they the do. You said the old dudes want to be abused. You don't think older niggas want to be? You don't think when you get old, you gonna want to be abused? No, yes, I can't you say it. Uh -uh. Because technically, I'm an old nigga. Okay. I, mean, I thought that I was still just like a middle-aged black man, but then I was alerted that since there's not a lot of black men, I was. Oh, elevated. you old? Oh, Cause yeah. it's not a lot of people that make it past 21. Yeah. yeah. That, ain't that fucked up? Yeah. We old before our time? Yes. Prematurely old. We missing a generation of black men, so we had to step up. So I'm technically like middle aged, but I have to represent for an old nigga demographic that ain't there. So. Mm -hmm. Ooh, that's right. Citizenship. Citizenship? Mm. I know you be liking them words and shit. Mm hmm. I studied. Mm -hmm. I went on your page just to see what type of lady you might be. And oh my God. Yeah, but you bringing out a different side in this interview I see. What type of side are you on? I don't bring know. What I don't, you want? Because I, I, I know you got a lot of strong opinions, and sometimes I just be wanting to get your opinion on really good shit. Boy. Sometimes yeah. I've been needing you to pop up and be like, tell me what the fuck going on in Ukraine and shit. How you okay. feeling about it? You are you know? serious? Are we, are, we, are we live? We just warming up. I'm are we warming up? Together. You know, these are rhetorical questions. Let me get my vocals together. La, 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 Before we get started, I gotta let you know, you look amazing today. Thank you. You, you do, too. You do your motherfucking thing. I like, I like how you look. You look yeah. like one of them niggas that just came fresh home from jail, ready to sling that dick. that you like. That's what I'm doing. Got mm -hmm. my old clothes on. I like that. Bracelet. I love that. <laughs> you feel me? Mm -hmm. Loose bra. Mm -hmm. uh, ooh. Oh, you got them thug drawers on? Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> Yeah, they still got, they do elastic, had, though. For real? I ain't had that in a long time. I know. I've been paper. What you been up to, though? Just out here working, doing my thing. Staying low key. No, no. See, you don't even know I live here. How the fuck am I supposed to do Because don't nobody know. Don't nobody know that I live you just here. Told that's, them. How, that's how low key I am. You told them that, though. Yeah. Damn. You, you cool with it now. Mm -hmm. Did you put a reef in? Mm -mm. Yes, you is. Mm -hmm. Well, what you is? Black. And what else? More black. I love that for you. Yeah, nah, I ain't mixed though. Not nobody we can see. I okay. Mixed. <laughs> my mama black. My daddy a nigga. <laughs>
Probably bad niggerish. <laughs> what's the difference my between black and niggerish? I never, never <laughs> hope. <laughs> my mother was strong black. My nigger. Yeah, this is crazy. My daddy never hold trash. Where my phone? This mine? No, that's mine. So where the one that was over here? Already. No, I was. I don't. One thing about it, I don't go through niggas' phone. Y'all go through mine. I let a nigga do what he did. I would never go through your phone. Oh yes, you would. No, I. You ain't even had this type of pussy, so you don't know what the fuck you would do. First of all, you ain't never had no cat like mine, so you don't know what you would do in life. You are absolutely right. Yeah, like niggas always tell me what they wouldn't do. That's got people going through. What you done got them to do? Keep it. Yeah, you. That, that's what y'all say online, them little memes. Oh, if you got the type of pussy that's gonna make me go crazy, keep it. Okay, I'll be trying to keep it. But y'all call me and say, tell me put my pussy on the phone or leave my pussy on the dresser. That's what niggas do. What is you doing that's making niggas do all this? <laughs> Who told you to leave it on the dresser? <laughs> <laughs> like, he wants you to put the pussy, like... <laughs> hey, man, welcome back to the 85 South Show. <laughs> But it is 2023, and the 85 South Show is responsible for a 3% increase in black childbirth. Come on, let's go. Everything that we do is for the black community. The Bus Drivers Association of America, Love they bus. had their annual meeting in December, and this might not mean shit to y'all, but they brought us up. What <laughs> we the number one show what? amongst people who need something to do at work. <laughs> yes. These are yes. small accomplishments, but to me, they mean so much. Do you know that we are the number one podcast watched in the stripper locker room? You don't, but I Come do. on, man. America <laughs> runs on 85 South. America runs on 85 South. And today, I feel like we have a very special treat. Come on. Not just a guest. Oh, this, this is a, a treat. treat. <laughs> this is because a treat. This is somebody that I hold in a very high regard. Come on. She speaks things and she stands on it. This Come lady on. is bold. This lady is, is courageous. Come on. This lady is a trendsetter. Come on. This lady has created her own lane. <laughs> and stayed over there and did her motherfucking thing with it. I'm proud of her because I watched all her movies and everything she said was true. Movies, I never... <laughs> these are movies to me. At my house, we watch them shit on the day. <laughs> I done been on vacation with you. I done seen you do things. I done seen you do things. <laughs> Everybody know Benny Hunter, but today we got Suki Hunter. Let's go. Trap. Come on, today. Come on. Suki with the good coochie. Yeah. Yeah, damn it. That's what I'm talking about. That was an about. introduction. And right everybody there. knows one of my favorite things in the world is good coochie. Is he? Yes. And today, I think we may be making history because I think you're the first guest that we've had on here that just has. Just flat out told everybody. And stood on it. And stood on it. Yeah. So we salute you, and this is your platform to use freely. Yeah, but the crazy thing is, I don't really like to talk about myself. It be these niggas, you know? That's, we, them, we are them niggas. That's exactly what I was leading up to. We them niggas. Y'all them niggas? We, we them niggas. Niggas. Oh, I feel real niggas, appreciated. Bro. Yeah, Not okay. them niggas, but yeah, we some okay. of, we, we, like, we know them niggas, too. We a monster. <laughs> <laughs> now, we're not those niggas specifically, <laughs> but we are in the demographic of the so Oh, my gosh. Niggas. Like, if we go somewhere and some ladies pulled up, and they left, they were like, it's some niggas in there. Okay, y'all them niggas. Those oh, that, right, okay, right, a period, right, I right, love right, that. If you went right. somewhere, yeah. you wouldn't be disappointed okay. that we were there. Mm -hmm. Like, you would be calling your friends, like, bitch, Yeah, it's niggas out here. Niggas out okay, here. Okay, all right, yeah, because right, that's what right, I do. Right. I call my friends. Yeah, it's niggas out here. So y'all yeah. them niggas, okay, yeah. I love that for us. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Stop doing that. Doing what? You don't like when I clean my teeth? Like... <laughs> I just I just was cleaning my teeth like oh, that. I ain't know. You don't I like that? That was a mating call. A yeah. mating call. I, mean, I, <laughs> I just got <laughs> Oh, so you single? Yeah, man, motherfucker, because they had tried to devalue me. Oh, I don't 
don't like that for you. Man, How they was trying to devalue you? Because I started listening to the words different. A motherfucker gonna tell me, you want everything to be your way. And I said, that bothers you? And then, without hesitation, she said, yes. And I said, well, who the fuck is supposed to be leading? Because I can't be listening to you. At all. Because I have more victories in life than you. So I feel like... If two people I'm, lead, everybody dies. That's what I'm saying. So it's like, I figured out a way to be successful in a, in a life that you're still figuring out. So why in the fuck would I listen to your instructions? You should want a nigga with better instructions than you. I'm not saying I'm always right. I'm just saying, I got better instructions. Sometimes. Do you at, did you at least listen no. to the advice? No. What if she says she no. don't want you out in them streets because no. she don't want you to get killed? No, I don't you ain't be gonna in listen. them streets. But if she said that you no. wouldn't listen? Of what course. if she say she don't want you to no, eat too listen. much salty food because it's going to give you diabetes? It's, it's you ain't going to listen? That, that's not the type of things that they're saying. Well, what what they were saying? Because we need to know now. See, the thing is, like, I don't know what happened, but something happened within the Matrix yeah. that made a lot of people, not just people, mm -hmm. made a lot of people feel the need to try to downplay other people's existence. Like, we all on this plane, right? Yeah. And we all have our own mission mm -hmm. and our own goals and objectives. We do. So it's like, even if you don't fuck with what I'm doing, it's not your purpose to try to talk me out of it or try to tell me that I'm on the wrong path or try to just fuck with where I'm going to fuck up my motion. See, I heard a lot, you know, like, a lot of people be saying they want a nigga with some motion. But then there's a lot of motherfuckers who want a nigga with some motion just so they can try to stop it. Because <laughs> they want it all. They want time. I ain't mean to go on a tangent or nothing, but the way y'all was looking at me, I couldn't let the room down. You explained, <laughs> you explained it, because a lot of women, we do like niggas with motion. Right, but don't stop a nigga motion. Yeah. Like, I feel like... Because you got you moving too much. That's what y'all gonna niggas. say. You ain't got no time for But her. you gotta start enjoying motherfuckers for where they are. Yeah. Sometimes it ain't that you supposed to be with nobody for no long time. It's like the moments that y'all can build within what y'all can agree upon. That's it. Yep, but that's how like, I feel. don't try to change a motherfucker mm -hmm. that you know you don't want. No. That's fucked up. I don't try to change these niggas. Don't. I just, I just love them freely. They change themselves for Sometimes me. Sometimes niggas be ready to change, though. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, I, 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 then, I accept the nigga for who he is. No, nah, because you be spoiling niggas a little bit, because I just saw this clip where you said you cook for other chicks niggas on Sunday. Yeah, take us through. Who, who cooking for you? And us Who niggas? cooking for you? Man, don't nobody love no, me. Don't nobody love me? Oh, I, I hate that for you, shit. friend. Mm -mm. Nobody ain't cooking for you. What you ate today? I hope it wasn't Taco Bell. Mm -mm. What was you? A chicken sandwich. Oh, you ate a chicken sandwich? You better come down here and get one. Mm. <laughs> But it, I don't like that for you. See, the type of bitch that I am, and we just I don't like that chicken your, sandwich shit. What be on your menu when you cook for these other niggas? It be the pan on a nigga like, you know, I might cook a sirloin steak, a T-boy steak, a T-boy. A T-boy, yep. okay. So, and then sometimes you might, I might got a... me one of them T-boy steak. <laughs> <laughs> you feel me? Chili. I might got a nigga that wants to be <laughs> Oh, you like chili? Uh, you like chili? What? You chili. No, I was just... Okay, well, she ain't fucking it. I'm not intimidate you. I'm not intimidate you. I ain't never ate no chili. What you like? Huh? What you like? As far as women? As far as food. Oh, food? Pussy, but... I mean, Pussy? Miss, I, mean, I mean to say that But I'm let not. me tell you something I'm before y'all no. even go anywhere. I might got a nigga that like T-bone. Okay. I might got a nigga that like spaghetti. So I might got a nigga that like southern fried pussy. I can feed any nigga. So you telling me on Sunday you got all these different meals going all at once. Yeah. And you just making mm -hmm. meal preps. For and how they come niggas. get them? They come get them out this ass. What's the most niggas you think you've had? <laughs> No, don't change the subject. Okay, no. Rotation. First of all, I was the most nigga. It was, first of all, it was a jokey joke. Right. But I will. I I love to cook. I'm a feeder. I will feed a man. I will feed him lunch, breakfast, dinner, dessert. Like I like to feed. That's what I like to do. You like to watch niggas eat. Too. Yeah, I like to watch them eat. That's what I like to That's do. That's freaky shit. It so is freaky. Be gaining weight when they fuck with yes, they do. They be getting fat. 
But you know, like, I just like to feed niggas. Like, you know, that's what I like to do. Especially if I feel like you're deprived and bitch is not cooking for you and you eating DoorDash and chicken sandwiches. I don't like that. I knew that was going to trigger yeah, you. Yeah, I don't. It, it really triggered <laughs> me right now. I'm really upset. Like, I don't like that for you. Like, but you, just, you just need know. to come get some of this lasagna. There you go. Yeah, you need some of this lasagna. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Love the convenience of getting what you want right to your door. With DoorDash Grocery Delivery, you can stock up for the week or order last-minute cravings conveniently. You trusted DoorDash to deliver your restaurant's favorites, and now you can get your grocery delivery that actually delivers straight to you. Yes, DoorDash is going to the grocery store. You hear me? With thousands of grocery stores to choose from, you'll find the best in your neighborhood and boost your local economy with each and every dollar. That's right. You're making a good in your hood with your dollar. Understood. You'll get exactly what you ordered. So we'll make it right. So sit back and enjoy quality groceries just like you pick from yourself. Listen, you want even more value? You can save on all your grocery and restaurants' favorites with $0 delivery fee. So they're going to get it. And they bring it right to you. You dig what I'm saying? Get 50% off your first DoorDash order up to a $10 value when you use code SOUTH2023 at checkout. Limited time off for terms apply, y'all. That's 50% off up to $10 on a $15 minimum subtotal and zero delivery fees on your first order when you download DoorDash app in the App Store and enter the code SOUTH2023. Don't forget, that's code SOUTH. 2023 for 50% off on your first order with DoorDash. Hey man, the summer is coming up and I know you're ready to get hot and heavy, especially heavy. So that's why I'm telling you, man, you need to go to bluechew.com and use the promo code 85 South at checkout and just pay $5 shipping. I'm telling you, that's why we've been able to keep this show going up for so long. Blue Chew sponsors this podcast, and that's why I want you to go and see what all the hype is about. I know you've seen the ads. I know you've seen them all over the place. We drop them in every show. Listen, the process is simple. Sign up at BlueChew.com, consult one of the licensed medical providers, and once you're approved, you'll receive your prescription within days. The promo code is 85SOUTH. You pay $5 shipping, and once you get the confirmation, you in the game. You'll be laid out like this here. For real, use the promo code 85 South at checkout and just pay $5 shipping. Shout out to Blue Chew for sponsoring this podcast. What that nigga Drake say? Now you're talking my language. <laughs> 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 okay. I got you though. So yeah. it's Sunday. Sunday. Can you text out like a menu Saturday night? So why? It seemed like so many guys that keep hitting me up and talking about, like, do I cook on Sundays? Like, everybody's really intrigued about you this. Said it. Yeah, oh, but it's like, know. okay, you nobody said... else cooking? No. <laughs> right? It's actually offensive these right. days. To nobody be else is cooking? Nah. Like, everybody, no, like, cook. I look at my DM, it's nothing else but niggas talking about, Suki, can I come over on Sunday? Are you cooking on Sunday? What you cooking? Are you cooking chicken? Cauliflower chicken, like it's just like it's nothing else. Niggas are sending requests. And it's yeah, they are, and it just makes me feel so bad for y'all because like you should. Like, where's the good woman at that like to really like feed niggas? Like I just love to do it. Like the niggas is selfish. Niggas done took all the good women. Yeah, they, and now y'all y'all picking out of a hamper, you know? Exactly. No. But it's it's a <laughs> lot of hamper. good of us. It, it's a lot of good women out here right now, though. I'm telling you. You just don't know how to find them. You probably nah, looking in the strip club. The numbers is off. So check this out. Most of the good women go. Then all the tall niggas took all the short women. <laughs> so now all the short niggas got is a bunch of angry tall women. <laughs> angry <laughs> tall all niggas. <laughs> tall ass women. So the tall niggas don't fuck with tall women. They come and find all the four foot elevens and all the four. Nines and all How tall are you? Not tall enough to be fucking <laughs> with these NBA size ass women. <laughs> when I'm arguing with a chick, she gonna drop her whole titty just on the top of my head. Can't see it for me. Ooh. Can't even see it for me. So you ain't suck it? Once I got it off my head. <laughs> but I wanna be respected too. Sometimes. Yeah, I love that. Yeah. All the time, really. 
This is crazy. I don't, need light I don't know what type of that. interview this is. This is a salute to you. Is it? This, oh. all, this whole episode is dedicated to you and your good coochie. I you ain't got to do nothing but sit there if you don't want to. Okay. I love that. I always want some really appreciation. I don't really have a whole lot of questions and shit like that. For real? You no. just kick it. I love when people, you know, appreciate me. We That's what I, because I like kink praising. You ever heard of kink praising? Yeah, like, yes, a good girl. Throw that ass back. Mm -hmm. yeah. I love That's what you like? Your savings account. Okay, all that okay. okay. What you say about the savings account? Yeah, see? What you, you said about the savings account? Put some money in your savings account. Put some you, money in the savings account? You gotta say that type of shit to keep her wet. You ain't really gotta do it. Encourage. No, you ain't gotta do it. That ain't, that ain't a part of the, that's not how it go. You open it up. You do you have can't. to do it. <clears throat> what you mean? You, if you gonna say you gonna put some money in her savings account, what you mean you don't have to do it? You ain't really gotta do that shit. You do have to do it. She ain't gonna save it anyway. So check this out. <laughs> I, got <a> <laughs> I got a question for you that I feel like only you can answer. Okay. Go ahead with the bullshit. It's, it's not hard. If, if your pussy, if they was making a movie about your pussy, mm -hmm. right, who would you want to play your pussy? Like, if you had to pick an actress that could play <laughs> your pussy, <laughs> yeah. who would you pick? Your pussy? Okay, who would I pick to play a coochie of mine? Yeah, your coochie. But they need an actress that can, that can like, bring this coochie to life. Who would you pick? Probably like Will Smith. To play. <laughs> <laughs> I would say, I mean, I don't know how to answer the question, but I probably would say Will Smith. You picked the, like, man. You picked the man to play your pussy. Not he's a really a good actor. <laughs> Not that good. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Cleo, Cleo. That nigga Cleo. ain't that good. Cleo. Queen Latifah? Yeah. Queen Latifah. The equalizer? Queen Latifah. Cleo. I feel like... You said it all. No. What's the movie that Jada Pink and Cleo... Set it and my, set set it it up. I feel like... I feel like Queen... My coochie and, and, and Cleo can relate because it's just like... So your pussy go just tear up at the end and smoke a cigarette. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like, but whenever, it's like a best whenever it's time to fuck something, she be like, best of I'm just going to ride into it. <laughs> <laughs> best of both worlds. Cleo was a gangster. Oh, you feel me? At the end of the best, motherfucking day. Oh, uh, okay. What the title be? The title of the movie? Yeah. Like, what type of interview questions is this? This type of shit. Like, what type of, okay, so what's the title? You, I be like, this type of shit. I be sitting there smoking a the blunt about this big. I be like, I right, ask her some silly shit. This the type of shit I be thinking. What would the title of the movie, what would you name the, the movie about my coochie? What would you name the movie? Because I just, like, I don't know. All sookie sookie now. <laughs> the Sookiana's coochie story. <laughs> <laughs> that trailer be crazy. Why he's still thinking, like, all sookie sookie now? I love that for me. Mm. Mm. You know they say you throw this motherfucker up in the air. Sunshine. Mm -hmm. Turn the lights out. Get these niggas a tan. And yeah, you already black. I'll turn your ass charcoal. You yes, I would. I'd be out there. You, huh? That's it. Huh? That's all? That's it? I'm the type of brown that don't get no brown. Yes, you do. I'm, you don't know what the fuck going on. I've been this brown my whole life. For real? Exactly. So that's the brown brown. Yeah. I love, I love that friend. They only, that's what I'm saying. The, the type of brown that I am, niggas is extinct. They extinct? They don't make these kind of niggas no more. You see how they just, niggas ain't this tone no more. They ain't. Oh. I love that, because I like that tone. <laughs> you just see it. He gonna say tone. Yeah. They stopped making niggas like that. Oh, for real? So that means you 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 special edition. Like a Pokemon card. <laughs> oh, shit! Exactly like a Pokemon card. I love that. Hell yeah. <laughs> Welcome back.
welcome to the 85 South Show. Yes, we going live today. Meet my man, Clayton English, and none other. World famous, Suki Oh, yeah. oh my gosh. You got new balances on? Yes. Also, you just came home from Prince. I didn't see that, I said I saw the, so you I'm just came. I'm the aesthetic all the way real. <laughs> what you know about a new balance? I'm just trying to get my life in balance. So I just started with Ooh. a new balance for Ooh. the new year. I got some pH balance for your ass. Start it now. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> you got, hey, I come out oh. with the test strip. <laughs> Put a test strip on that pussy. Hey. Oh, this is great. <laughs> a litmus test. Baby, I got a scratch and sniff. Yeah. You remember the cracker, the, cra the, uh, the box with the, uh, what, what was the scratch and sniff with the cracker back? What was it? Cracker Jack. Yeah, Cracker Jacks. Mm -hmm. You know, the scratch and sniff, you scratch it and you smell it. What advice would you give to the ladies who might be watching this show how they can make the coochie better? I mean, I feel like, first of all, elasticity, that's uh, uh, genetics, oh. you know? So, baby, it come from your mama and your grandmama, so I don't know. And your grandma? Yep, grandmama, great-grandmama, like I said, but all the way back to the Egyptian times. Wow. Wow. Mm -hmm. okay. <laughs> it come from the blood, so, like, you know? Because some girls can, like, I it's girls out here that will fuck multiple niggas, and it's girls out here that will fuck one nigga with a big ass stick and get fucked every day. It depends on your elasticity. It don't matter what you do, you know? Elasticity. Right. <laughs> you so know what you elasticity is? It, yes. If you ain't born with it. If you ain't born with it, you ain't born with it. Ain't no hope. Nah, cause you put something on my mind. I'm thinking about all the girls I know who got good pussy and I'm thinking like, they mama. Yep. What you think about that's fucking their mama? No, I'm just saying, like, what if that's now? Like, what that if that's you said? like the family version of pussy? <laughs> like everybody in the family got that mom. Yeah. That's how my family yeah. is. That's why everybody got a whole lot of kids. For real? Mm -hmm. What's I got a, a lot of kids. Lot? You a got lot? a lot? How many? Seven. You got seven? <laughs> no, I got three. <laughs> see, but, you see, yeah, you try to get <laughs> you the high number. Don't try to answer that. I want to see what you want to say. That's what they do, hit you with the high number, then drop down. I wasn't gonna say shit. No, I got I'm playing Sam. Okay, that ain't that bad. <laughs> no, I always say that when they ask me. I say seven, but no, I got three. That's good. But you, niggas always be trying to get me pregnant. But I'm not gonna let it happen. Who are these niggas? <laughs> right. like, all niggas. All no, like I be fucking with like, you know, I got my in rotation. That's the problem. But the thing is, right now I'm single though. It's, I'm not saying a, niggas like a whole lot of niggas. It'd be literally like rotation. two niggas. Yeah, but, but I single. go Yeah, like I might go back. Like if I, you know, I might go back to Spend the block. Who, who, yeah, spend the block because I don't want no. I don't want to be talking to everybody. I want everybody talking about this cat. So I just they go back to. Are. Yeah, they gonna talk about it, but these. I don't, I need to make sure I fuck on the right nigga. That's going. You know. What? Ain't no right nigga. It ain't nothing. No, no right. No, you have to find your. Nigga. But to see one of the niggas I was fucking with, he gonna say, yeah. After he fucked me, he gonna say, yeah. I'm gonna tell everybody that that pussy trash and you was telling me that you love me and out of state, so that he gonna say, so that nobody don't wanna fuck with you. So that's that why I gotta be careful. Work. That shit don't never work. work. No, because it's too many niggas in the world. He ain't gonna be able to tell everybody. That shit has never worked. When niggas <laughs> like, man, that pussy ain't shit. Yeah, I, I'm gonna see. <laughs> well, well, we gonna find out. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait. Niggas, nobody, nobody's so, taking so niggas. So y'all know niggas be lying? Yeah, yeah, nobody taking no nigga word on this shit. She ain't like fucking you, sir. <laughs> that pussy was amazing. She did all types of tricks when it came to me. What this the bitch fuck? Grabbed the ceiling fan. I hope, hopefully, I never have to really like have be around nobody that done been in the, in the pussy that I'm currently visiting. I don't like the shell now. Like I feel like you it, don't like the like, shell. You got like a roommate. You should, yeah, you shouldn't be fucking in certain like like if you, you fuck, got a roommate. You should spread your fucking out. Don't fuck a lot of people in the yeah. one area. No, yeah, that's yeah, crazy. They bring your value. But down. I ain't never fuck a Atlanta nigga yet. No, oh, I did one, one of them. But See, I've been here for, I've been here since I was 12, and I only fought one Atlanta nigga. Like the Atlanta don't even know what type of pussy I got that's out here, and it really, me? it really can stop the crime out this motherfucker in the bluff. Well, why, 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 why are you not you? putting this on the street? I just ain't fighting. <laughs> <laughs> you <laughs> 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 
left and right, <laughs> day in and day out. <laughs> And you won't do nothing. No, I just I just haven't been around like that, you know. Well, at least teach a course or something. Help. I just ain't been outside community. like that. Nah. All right. May 20th. Where we're going? Louisville, Kentucky. Man, to the who? The KFC Yum Center. We ain't got no KFC yet. But it's going to be at the Yum Center. Is it, is it Louisville or Louisville? It's Louisville. Louisville. Yeah, definitely Louisville. Louisville. Yeah, Louisville. No cap. It's Louisville. Louisville. Nine in the back. I need Louisville. I need KFC to bring us is, some chicken, bro. Is that close to the uh, Kentucky Derby? It's in Kentucky. I mean, but is it close to the day that we're gonna be there? Hey man, fuck all that. Bring me some bluegrass. For real. Is Bubba Johnson gonna be there? Bubba Johnson? Yeah. That nigga. Bubba Johnson ride horses. He the NASCAR. Can Kentucky? I thought that was a car. No, nigga, that's. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man, come to the show. Come to the show a little bit. Bring a horse. Ignore what he said. Yeah. Ah! You tough, y'all, yeah, baby. That's the NASCAR girl? Yeah. I thought he'd take it there with the car. No, that's. Ah! That's the <laughs> Daytona 500. Nigga, nigga. Derby. Ain't nobody told me. That's why I won't take you no fucking way. Hey, man. Get, get your tickets. May 20th, KFC Yum Center. Shit, take me to the horses then. You got that, yum. Yeah, you got that. But I always thought the Kentucky Derby was the horse, I mean, with a car. Columbus, Ohio. Ohio. Columbus, Ohio. Columbus, Ohio. In Palestine. Columbus. It's Columbus. Yeah. Pa the, what was it? The yeah. Popeye's Theater? Uh, oh, Palace. I thought it was the Palace Theater and the Popeye's Theater. We going to the <laughs> Palace Theater. Yep. May 21st. Columbus, Not planned. Ohio. You know what I'm saying? Come on. Yeah. Bow Wow yeah. gonna be there. Yeah, and yeah. we going to shopping at Eastland Mall. No I'm cap. I'm, I'm going. A little Bow Wow, you just don't know. Me when you move so fast, hey, I got the flow. I'm gonna make up to my mind. Okay, uh. I'm not uh, doing this, uh, Bow Wow. Yeah, uh, uh, you boys said, Bow Wow gonna pull up for me. Hey, he gonna pull up for me. All the way. <laughs> Get your tickets, Slim. Yeah. Get your tickets. May 21st. No Columbus, cap. Ohio. Come on, get your tickets. Get your tickets. May 21st, no Columbus, cap. Ohio, Palace Theater. You remember that nigga, you remember that nigga did this shit in the, in the camera? Hey, man, bro. You still might be, you know what I mean? Yeah, all the way. Get the ticket. That's crazy. My mama made sure we was homeschooled. For real? Mm-hmm. So I ain't never get to show this pussy to the world like that. Well, where was you? That's why you a freak like that. Mm-hmm. That's why I'm was, real nasty. You was caged up. Mm-hmm. Caged so up. where was you fucking the niggas at? You was fl flying the pussy out? You exporting? <laughs> Yep, import, export. Damn, damn. Mm -hmm. When did you know? That's crazy. When did you know it was hidden like that? I think it was the pregnancies, like just keep being pregnant over and over and over again. So I feel like, and then niggas be acting crazy. Like they be doing shit, like stalking Good a bitch. Shit. Crazy no, shit. crazy. Like you don't know how much, how much uh, uh, what's what's it called when you put a restraining orders I got on niggas? Crazy as shit. What's the number? How many niggas on the block list? I have a, I, uh, how many niggas on the block list? In life, like you said, the restraining order. I mean, I ain't gonna act like it's a lot, but it's a couple, it's you a know? That shit might be dangerous. You might have to take it off the street. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I need to figure it out. I'm still learning life. I just needed me an old head that's gonna teach me to write, you put know? Put it up. Mm -hmm. Put it, it up. Put it up. Put it up. Put it up. Okay, I'm gonna put, put it that up. motherfucker up. Yeah, I'm gonna put it up. Because if niggas ain't gonna learn how to act when, when motherfuckers come over your house and they get to arguing and shit, what your mama say? Hey, put yeah, all that Yeah, and I'm shit sick up. of these niggas trying to argue and put their motherfucking hands on me and shit. Yeah, first of all. Oh, no, fuck all that. Yeah. All that, all that violence. That's what we're trying to do. Because a little bit, like, just bro. choke me up when you fucking me. Yeah, spit in my mouth. Yeah, let me ride that dick. Let me slap you up. Let me fart in your face. What? Let no, me no, no, piss. No. Let me piss in your mouth. Yeah, like stuff like that, but don't, ain't no pulling my wig this out. This is a family show. This is a family show. This is not a fucking Zeus. <laughs> not a tubing movie. But that's what I'm saying, like, don't, don't be trying to put your hands on me. Let me fuck you up. Let me break that dick off. Shove that dick in my throat. Choke me. Make me go to the Amberlands. What you call it? The Amberlands. Yeah, yeah. What? I like it. Okay. I sound like a brother and sister. Amber Lance. Amber Lance? Get your ass in this car. Amber and Lance? <laughs> <laughs> What's your motivation? Who inspires you? I mean, 
feel. Who inspires me to do what? To make my music? Everything. To... Some people that inspire you in general. Well, I like Lil Wayne. Word. Mm hmm I like Harriet Tubman. I like, um, motherfucking shit. she had that fact. Yeah, she did. Yeah. You know she did. She, she didn't take no too. motherfucking shit from these niggas at all. She and she had that waist shirt on with that uh, four right. five yeah. tucked under. That's why she was able yeah. to sneak so good. Yup. Yeah. That's what I. And that's why all them old black men followed her. Mm -hmm. So the ass was fat. Had at I, first they weren't finna listen. Had I follow you anywhere? Yeah. <laughs> 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 Quiet down. Now, which way is it, Harry? <laughs> <laughs> niggas following that ass, boy. That's a freedom. Okay. Take these niggas to freedom with that cat. <laughs> <laughs> well, shit, I'm inspired by my motherfucking self. That's what's up. Mm-hmm. Harry Tubman. I didn't expect that one. No, I really do love her, though. Yeah. Too. And I love Lil Wayne. She put that thing out too on shit. She put yeah. that thing out on Yeah, yeah. And I, I love Michael Max. And I and I love, who else in the game? Pastor Troy. Like I told you, play that pop that pussy, show them niggas you ain't scared. Yeah. Like, you know. Yeah. Shit, Judd, oh, Kingpins inspired me. Oh, word. Tell me about the music game. What made you start fucking with the music game? So I've been making music since I was a, a jit. Yeah. A, a young girl. You know, my mom made my first song. And then I just kept going. You know, I love to make music. I love to say how I feel. And the crazy part is like, I feel like when I make music, it liberates me. Like I'm gonna say some shit that people ain't used to hearing. Like right. when I get in a booth, cause I'm more of a comedian, I'm on the comedian side. Oh, word? Yeah, so I like to me say too. shit that's funny. I know, that's why I said we was real compatible. We compatible? Yeah, cause what's, what's your sign? I'm an Aries. Uh, Aries, yeah, I don't like Aries like that. For real? Mm -mm. Yes, the fuck you do. That's why no, you said. No, I, I ain't <laughs> never talked to an Aries, but I was just talking How to you one the other day. Like Cause I was talking to one other, the other day, and that's one. Yeah, but y'all cool. all the same. Cause no, what's the fuck we know. how y'all look? How y'all sign look? You don't need no nothing about horoscopes. <laughs> <laughs> that shit don't mean you know. <laughs> who needs that type of shit? <laughs> I don't believe your birthday got shit to do with who you Baby, are. Baby, I'm a person. Scorpio, and everything you hear about a Scorpio is me, for real. Everything. Everything. Even when they tell you that they're shitty people. Yeah. They petty. Oh. No, she said shitty, but we ain't shitty like that. I'm saying, they, I, I you ain't heard never that. heard that, but you heard that we was the best sign, baby. Nobody ever said that. Yes, they did. Well, Nobody. we say it. Nobody. We Scorpio say it. I know, but it's nobody. Can we get? What's the question that he asked me before? Uh, nothing about your birthday. You so was what we said? My birthday. You ain't gonna get me what shit. The, what was the question that we said? I, I will get you something. One thing about it, I'll, I always get my nigga shit. I want a Hellcat. A Hellcat. So what that mean? You gonna give me a Maybach? Cause one thing oh. about it, you spend. Oh no, the shit, you ain't getting motherfucking thing. You ain't even get pussy. You ain't even get nothing to eat. I don't know. Okay, don't do the shit. Look, Fuck the Hellcat. Because one thing about it, I don't even like niggas that, that ride that Hellcats no more. This you should have worked your way into Why the Hellcat. Why would you sit there and tell me what you want and then I tell you what I want and you said you would I had a phase in my life where if you, was, if you said pussy or the Hellcat, I'm picking the Hellcat. And I'm in the phase of my life if you said dick. Or Maybach, I'm picking a motherfucking Maybach. Shit, I'm tired of dick. I got, a, I got three deal dogs. Dick and dick. <laughs> the what? Them only two choices. Dick that's all you offer in a bitch, and that's why you eat. That's why you eat chicken home. sandwiches from Chick Fil A. No, that's why your ass hungry. No, it ain't. Yes, it is. Cause if I put this dick down like I really could, I bitch go bring me a grocery store. Is she? The whole thing with the even the part with the little liquor store at the back. The, the whole, Publix, the Publix Plaza. I know that's why I, I ain't never met. I ain't need, never met no nigga that do that yet. Come on, man. Yeah. You ain't met me. Yeah. My name is Carlos but Miller. How you doing? I ain't even gonna shake your hand because I'm gonna let you know I'm not one of them bitches that you used to fuck with. I know. That's the crazy part. Because you thought that you was finna get a Maybach and you was finna drop some I dick and that's all you was finna a offer. Oh, want you wanna help? Okay. Yeah, skirt, skirt, no. <laughs> so, come on now. No, one thing come about on it. Now. If a bitch gives you a Hellcat, what you, you, you saying that you only gonna get her a dick? It's okay. And that's okay? So are you tripping? Ooh, y'all niggas, are, what you saying? Do say? you understand what, what I am? 
My value? I ain't asking no hell cat. That's why that girl left your ass. I didn't come in low, right? She did. You ain't said. Nobody you never said. Left me. What the girl? You said that she was never. with somebody. Never. I am not that nigga. I told you the type of nigga. So that tell I. me why the bitches stay. Besides why would dick. they leave? Besides dick. Besides dick. Oh, tell I'm coming me in why. low. I want a PlayStation Five. <laughs> That's oh, it. See, I'm, I'm coming in low. Like, see, I'm. And I'm gonna fuck it off. You gonna fuck, fuck it off. off? Yeah, I'm gonna fuck it off. A I can fuck off a PlayStation 5. That's like a fuck I can fuck head. off. That's huh? a fuck. That's what I'm saying. That's easy. <laughs> One good fuck yeah. You get a PlayStation that's same But you night. said the Hellcat, you lost I the pool, you lost pussy. <laughs> she wouldn't even <laughs> shake your head. Cause you you negotiating Tell wrong. Come in low and work your way up. That's what I wanted to I'm about to change everything that she been doing. How you gonna do that? First of all, off the rip, once you mind, I'm about to grant you three wishes. I'm about to do three things in a row that you ain't even think was possible. <laughs> First of all, your mind blown three times. So you saying that now I'll just believe three. In it. She believe in a nigga now. Now her confidence. So you a genie. Up. This nigga can do everything. Like, you, all he you gotta he... do is three <laughs> good things back to back to back. <laughs> I'm telling you, bro, these women ain't used to shit. Oh, okay. Bruh, feed a motherfucker four times. She's gonna be like, you trying to get me fat. Like, no, this is what normal people do. We eat every day. So you feed Two a bitch times. four times and then expect yes. the hell cat. No. Your whole life about to change. So what tell me how the life about to change. I'm trying to understand what you doing that make a bitch say, you know what, I ain't even fun to fuck no other nigga. You see how the game's so fucked up? Do you think a nigga have to do something to increase your value? I am the value. What? Do you understand how many doors is, everything is about okay? to open just because you fucking with me? You just unlocked a whole oh. other set of keys you didn't even know you had. Look at you. Getting all these opportunities. I'm over here getting your confidence back right, your skin flourishing, hair done got back long, ass done got fat like it used to be before the baby. How you doing that? How? Don't worry about what we doing at my house. Just know that you gonna see results. I'm finna make you go home and throw away so much shit. All your favorite outfits don't is you Listen, no is you paying the bitch bills or not? That's what we need bills? to know. Bills? You ain't paying a bitch bills? bills, but you want a bitch to buy you a oh, Hellcat? You think bills? Oh, that ain't how I go. Wait, wait a minute. First of all, you think some bills intimidate a grown man? No, you not think, intimidate. Is you, you paying think, them or is you not paying them? You think that's how we pick women? We can look at a bitch who got too many bills. Like, uh, uh she, uh, no, no. <laughs> we see who's in front the of us. You ain't answer the that. question. <laughs> Is you helping a bitch pay her bills? Do you not? Or are you just say, fucking and go? I'm changing her life. You think I'm just gonna? No, let I wish you to answer the question. Notice? I wish you to answer. Is you helping a bitch pay her bills? Yes or no? Listen. You don't want to answer that. I'm about to answer. This not no just yes, yes or no, no question. Yes, it is. No, it's not. I just <laughs> okay. told you, fucking with me increases your value. It's just like manifested. So many things are happening so fast. You like. Who was paying these bills? And they're not being not paid, but I got you believing so in yourself. You so you paying much. them. Your credit score is up. I done showed you how to You eliminate. making a bitch want to work harder to pay her bills. I eliminate half of these fucking bills. Uh-uh. So you showing a oh, bitch. Oh, yeah, I got oh, it. No. I know, I so got you it. See what I'm saying? You know. <laughs> Let me get you. You showing you a bitch here. how to pay her bills. <laughs> and it's like it's both <laughs> all, Okay, you want the short answer? Listen, it doesn't even matter. I'm going to pay the bill for everybody. I'm going to do that. Okay, she okay. Some help. She need a couple dollars. I'm going I'm to sit no, there. No, not say, if she needs. I'm like, what you she need? She might not need it. She might do, though. But what if she don't? Nine times out of ten, she do. But what if she don't? What if she don't? So she's just being extra, just trying to charge me? You know what? What? What about you? Don't ask him. I'm no, him. no, I'm gonna ask him. Hey, no. I'm paying the bills where I stay. He is neutral in this. So you paying the bills? I'm paying the bills where I stay. That's what I'm saying. That shit don't bother me. I'm the paying the bills you know where hold I up. stay. Hold up, hold up. That's what I'm saying. Let me talk to him. No, I got you. He gonna if pay you the bills fucking where this girl. I'm paying the bills where I stay. Talk your shit. Okay, I understand that. So. I ain't no so other. if you stand with y'all other bitch, but you fucking the side hoe, you ain't you ain't got nothing to do with that no. bill. Hey, this one hey, you got. Hey, I'm paying the you bills. You have to pay the bills. I look, stay. listen. This is this is the thing about it. To all the niggas out there who ain't oh. figured it out yet, pay all the bills. That's the first thing. So that way you don't. You, you, even if you did as wrong, 
Some if you over there all the you time, all the you owe something, fuck nigga. Motherfuckers listen to me. <laughs> you over there all different. the time, you right. nigga. Right. You owe something. You do. Motherfuckers listen different when you pay all the bills. <laughs> Hey! Yeah, yeah, I everybody, do. Everybody, yeah. Everybody stand up in the house. Yes? So I do I'm listen saying. different. We passed that point in our life where this could turn into, oh, wait, man, the bitch bills. Man, these motherfuckers. No, because I thought that's what really you. Be if you don't pay the bills, you they don't. Have they it. don't at all. But, but hey. I thought that's what you were saying. And mm-hmm. I was finna say, like, you sitting here telling me that you finna fuck on a girl. She she there for you. You with her all the time. You having fun with this bitch and you ain't gonna pay no bills. Listen to me, though. I'm gonna I'm do that. Because I'm that's the type of nigga that I am. It's I'm nothing wrong with saying that, though. This is what I'm saying. I'm upgrading her entire life. It's not that she even gonna need me to be giving her Explain, money. Explain. Like, no, 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 okay, no, no, so no. Tell that ain't how it is. Yeah. How well, you said this nigga said he give a bitch three wishes. She get three right? wishes. What is the wishes, nigga? <laughs> what's the wishes? We we need to know. Like, what's the wishes you talking about? <laughs> It's your girl Lex P and I have a very special announcement. Well, I already announced it, but I'm gonna let y'all know again. We are going on tour. It's starting in June, y'all. Look, we announcing it extra early so y'all got time to get your tickets. No excuses. We got LA, Philly, Chicago, Atlanta, Houston. Now, listen to me, because I know how y'all get. We are still adding dates. I repeat, we are still adding dates, but if you see your city right now, go ahead and get your tickets. If you don't see your city don't worry we still coming okay so make sure y'all go to www.poorminds.com and get y'all vip meet and greets we all fly poo okay give me the scenario what who is this lady who is this lady okay so I mean, if you're talking to somebody, that's you. I know, you. but you, I mean, you, this hypothetical, so you give me. You, you talking to this woman, you talking to this woman that you admire. I admire her. You admire her. She like me? She like you as well. Okay. Isn't she it supposed bad. to be a mutual thing? She bad, she bad. Not she just got, fuck she, being bad. Everything. She got good coochie. People is You gotta beautiful. put that in there. If, okay, because sometimes yeah, good coochie do matter. Because I need to know how to he gonna try to find, All right, so yeah. I'm gonna tell you something since you keep, you you love to act like you don't want to answer a question. I can you, okay, so you got a woman that you like, you admire. She bad as fuck, the pussy good. You come in three minutes every time. She suck your dick, lick your gooch, she cooking for you, and she making sure that she check on you and making sure you genuinely okay. Right. And you coming to her house at least four times out of the week because you always want to fuck. Right. So you ain't finna help her with no bills? I'm gonna stop fucking with her. You know she what? She my gooch. I'm a grown man. Ain't nobody supposed to be looking at me. First of all, if you don't respect what me you gonna enough, do? No, what don't fucking gonna... lick me right there. Don't do it, don't do it. No, I'm not through fucking with it. I'm cutting it off. He said, don't lick me cut. right there. We not there yet. Oh, 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 oh. Hey. Oh. hey. 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 So you said don't lick me right there. Okay, so. Hey, I'm it's... done. I'm done. Because she's a goddamn freak, first of all. Because who asked for that? Can I get some more cast amigo? She can lick the gooch, but can't text back. <laughs> so she, hey, hey, where are you at? <laughs> That's what it takes, Captain. Get big, she, she focused on the wrong shit. He don't want to answer nothing, I see. Fuck the licking uh, the gooch. If you saying that, you don't. What she, what she do? She genuinely cared about but you. But I'm saying, what's she, she checking do on you? What's her profession? Where she pro- work? I mean, there's women that work nine to five or RNC and it's her a, income. Why does it matter? Thirty k. Because I'm trying to put my plan together. Thirty k. Thirty k. She don't make too much. She don't make too much. She what? She don't make too much. She she's an average go. working woman. Thirty k. Yeah, she don't make too much. She pay. She, she make enough just to pay her bills, but she, not enough to to dress in designer. All right, check this out. I hate to be this guy, sucker, but you said since I'm not asking you enough, I'm not finna do all that for no woman making 30000 So it depends on how okay, much she Okay, so they make. changed a lot. So it, it... I just can't see that for me. You are not about to do what? This pay? She not asking for nothing. She just asking you to help her I with know, her bills. she gotta go to work. She don't have time. So you ain't gonna me. help her with nothing but you fucking her? Uh-uh. That's not okay. No, because you act like she giving me, like she doing me a favor. I'm giving her dick that she can't even afford. I feel like if you. <laughs> 
<laughs> she supposed to be fucking no nigga like me. I feel like if you if you genuinely <laughs> not she the most popping bitch. You know what? Like, that's why I say. That's why I say I'm not finna love a nigga for who he is no more. Fuck these niggas. Fuck these niggas. Just spending money. He took me up to two Macy's. And to we went, Macy's. And we went to Saks too. To, she made thirty thousand. This is what she shop at anyway. I done took her to two different Macy's. Took her to the Saks. Let her hit Target three times. She done had to buy a whole nother bag to check. She niggas be capping so bad. She done got drunk off liquor. She can't even pronounce what's that shit. That Cosmo. Casamiga. Casamel with the bell yeah. on the top. I'm the one that looked like the hookah. She took the ball home and shit. Babe, go home and throw all your clothes away. Why? Because I'm finna send you all the shit we bought in Vegas. You for real? Ciao. This is so crazy. You get, yeah. That's why I like yes. light skinned niggas. So you telling me you ain't gonna do shit for a bitch at you all? Did not, you will not give me credit for the first thing that I said. What you saying? I told you. Just by fucking with me. Yeah, you finna change a bitch life. You finna make her think, oh, save your money and budget. What the fuck you finna she do? She ain't about to have to do shit. All them little weak ass bills, poof, they don't exist. How they don't exist? Though we need to, we need to. Cause I'm a big dog. I oh, you a bit, I change the life. As you should. Hell yeah. And Call I, JG Wentworth on a bitch. Oh, JG Wentworth. Eight seven seven cash that. now. Cash now. <laughs> cash. <laughs> cash. What you mean, what she get by fuck with me? They got dental insurance now. Dental they insurance? They got LASIK. I mean, if you getting a bitch teeth fixed, Bae, that's, that's ma that matters. That, all yeah. of that. Babe, take the car you drive and just push it off a ditch. You hate that car anyway. We finna get a new. Oh, you don't like, you, hey, I don't like when I come over your house, I gotta wait outside the gate. Pack all your shit, we, I got you a spot. All of this shit happens. Leave, a, leave this shit. You stupid. Hey, I don't like you living over here. Apartments give me the creeps. I believe it's black mold over here. I, all that. <laughs> oh, this couch, it ain't enough room for both of us. He I'm said apartments over. give me the creeps. <laughs> <laughs> apartments give me the yeah, creeps. Apartments give me the creeps. I don't know who lives in the door. I don't really listen to the music. We can't barbecue over here. Let's let's just get a house. Oh, we dog. can't barbecue. Don't you want a dog? What kind of little dog you want? Oh, my whole Oh boy, get him away. I get you one. Oh, this, why are you crying? Why are you crying? You crying every I got a cockadoo. I upgrade your life. <laughs> Come on, man. I mean, you try me long as they no, I'm just trying to understand. Look how much fun I'm having on that picture right there. You oh, think look shit. at look at that. That's somebody mama throwing that ass. Throwing that on ass. That's my grandma. Come on, man. A tag say auntie. But she's somebody grandma. Come on, man. I mean, I, I love that for you, especially if your woman happy. You saying they so happy and they ain't got, they, you just oh, changing their minds and the shit. Thing. That's all it's about. That's shit. That's the thing about it, though. It's like doing so much shit to make somebody else so happy, it just makes you unhappy. Who yeah. Who go back into me? Mm-hmm. See how quiet she got? Let me hit some of that weed. Can I smoke? I don't smoke like that, but can I hit the weed one time? I didn't know you wanted to. No, I don't, I don't yeah. smoke, but... All right, no, I'm not going to do it because I'm like, well, don't, so, don't get I no laugh too much. No yeah, because, <laughs> no, I see? smoke at times, but I just laugh too much. And you already funny as hell. Oh. You got a weed chain, so yeah. you, that's what you do. I'm sponsored by weed. Weed? Yeah. Ooh, so you <clears> must be exotic. I love that. You something strange for a piece of change. No. Not for a piece of change? Oh, something okay. real, then we can chill. <laughs> 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 I'm just fucking with you, man. You know how we do over here, okay. man. We talk big shit and things like that. I see the phone. I'm having up. a good time. This is not my phone. This is not my phone. See where you at? Yeah, but this is not my phone. So don't say that. It's people trying to see where I'm at. I mean, of course they're going to try to see where I'm at. Motherfucker got to know. Mm -hmm. Your location on or no? It's not on. So what else do you like to do besides walking around with good cooch? I mean, well, first of all, I don't really like to walk around with good coochie because my legs be hurting. So usually you'll see my I'm manager. Yeah, you'll see my manager push me in a wheelchair. Because oh. it just be like my knees. It just be like, oh my gosh, she hurts so bad. Because it's, it's like, oh, it's, got nothing to do with it's, like it's like fat, it's like heavy, and it's juicy. It's like, damn, I'm carrying a submarine around, like, you know. But besides that, 
I really like to read. You might have osteoporosis. I like to cook. <laughs> what? Your knees might be fucked up. I, osteoporosis? <laughs> <laughs> your pussy should not be affecting your knees. For real? You don't if your pussy that, that good where your knees is bad? Come on, man, talk to her. A wheelchair? I need a chiropractor. You know what? That's crazy. She got to get wheeled around. Mm -hmm. What's wrong with her? That pussy too good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> too good. Mm -hmm. I told you this whole episode, we were just going to give you praise and admiration. Yeah. I mean, we having a good work time. that you're doing in the community. Yep. Doing my community service as I should. Yeah. And you say you've been doing music the whole time, like since you was little? Yeah, I've been making music. How long you been freaky, though? I mean, I think it was like, like soon as I was like 17. 17. No. But I think honestly, like at, when I hit 30, like it's just like, right now it's just like, I don't know what's going on. You don't like, have no idea. Nope. Damn. Dick ain't never felt this good. They ain't hit your peak yet. Nope. And Dick ain't never felt this good. Like I usually fake orgasms, but now I ain't got a fake. Sometimes the fake ones be hidden though. Yep. They the ones that you need to keep your confidence up. No, I ain't think that. I do. So you talking about you faking? No, I'm saying like... Because you know they said niggas be faking orgasms and spit on a bitch ass act like they can't. Yeah. <laughs> I got to go. <laughs> Nigga be in a hurt, like, it's just something changed. You like, I got to go. No, yeah. ah, all right, I'm good. <laughs> I did not nut. I did not nut at all. <laughs> I'm going to have to jack off at the house. Oh, my gosh, what? <laughs> something was wrong. Something was wrong. Might have been roaches, but anything could have gone wrong. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Could have been older, could have been anything. You might have to. Uh, I think uh, women are the number one to fake orgasms. Yeah, y'all do it. Yeah. We do it for the same reason, self-esteem. We don't want to hurt right. y'all. And y'all don't want to hurt y'all. We don't want to hurt y'all. Do your thing. Exaggerate so I feel like, the hell out of that shit. I mean, that means somebody care about you. That's, that's real. We're just people. We don't just manage. ordinary people. Yeah, just human beings. <laughs> Do whatever you gotta do to make this shit fun. It's really just supposed to be about having some fun. Exactly. You ain't trying to make a baby. Shit, I'm trying to have some fun. I'm trying to get turned the fuck out. Sick of these niggas my age. How old are you? Uh, young and fine. 30. Just 30. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, you getting there? Mm hmm. Hey. Got this southern fried cat. See, you still. Mm -hmm. you been and now I feel like I'm I'm seasoned. Like I feel like I'm seasoned now. Now you feel me? I know what to do with this motherfucker. What you gonna do with it? Shit. Thirty. Throw it on a nigga face. First off the top. Suffocate him. It's murder. Yeah. This is murder, nigga. Bro, this shit is so funny because us as niggas, this is the type of shit that we train for. Like, when niggas go home and they train for pussy war, we have scenarios where you have to not breathe. If, if, a, if a woman ever try to suffocate you with a pussy, yeah. as an adult man, you already know what to do. Put your chin up. What you do? Get your nostrils free. It's he telling you. Put your chin up and get your nostrils free. Exactly. <laughs> You gotta get your, in, you gotta in the get worst your, case scenario, you gotta get your nostrils. <laughs> your parachute is if, you, if she won't move, just stick your finger in her, and she gonna yeah, jump up. Yeah, yeah, you gotta. It's like getting the eject button. You gotta, you gotta. Got hey, <laughs> hey, <laughs> hey, <laughs> hey, <laughs> hey, <laughs> hey. <laughs> you can't get your nostrils free, so you gotta bail out. Come on, man. Are you serious? If you can't get your nostrils free, you put your thumb in her booty, and that's the eject. To make her get off? That ain't gonna lie, that is true. <laughs> Cause no bitch want no nigga thumb straight up her ass. Like it's no, like, it's okay, nice. let me move a little bit. And no man wants want to be... die suffocated by pussy. Nobody. And you ain't gonna die. You ain't gonna die. All of it. You ain't gonna die. You ain't gonna die. Shit. Type shit. <laughs> y'all need some coochie juice on your face. I have to make y'all beard grow. Jeez. That's how my beard turned gray. Is it? You see, it's only gray in the beard, bro. That's that salt and pepper. Pussy. It's so it drained all the yeah, pussy got that bleach in it. <laughs> pH. It yeah. do. It's a city. That's that piss. <laughs> Ammonia. Ammonia. <laughs> it got bleach. <laughs> <laughs> no. 
you just say anything. No, I mean, That's what for you real, talk for about real, piss, no, first of all, piss and squirt ain't the same thing. That's what I say? Yeah, because I'm a squirter, so I know. Yeah, that's yeah, what I say. Yeah, a veteran. And piss and squirt ain't the same motherfucking thing. It only be these hating ass hoes that like the Niggas don't never say nothing like that. It be you hating sure? ass Because I done tasted it before. Yeah, but I mean, a bitch was pissing on you. But if you what, what taste What's your face look squirt... like when it, when it... Chicken bouillon. Nah, so So you said it tastes like piss when the bitch. Hey, man. Well, I mean, that might be her. <laughs> but it, it's some bitches that, that squirt in the snapple. What you think pussy Chicken tastes broth. Like? Huh? What you think pussy tastes like? Pussy tastes like? I feel like pussy just tastes like a little, little, let me think if I could, because I like to cook, so let me compare it to an ingredient. Skin and pee pee. That's it. This is no, I'm not going to say pee pee, because at times maybe pee pee. Who says pee pee? Just what say piss. Just say pee. No. <laughs> pee pee? That's too many. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I mean, like a little bit of uh, Snapple. A little good. bit of almond, mm. almond milk. Pussy don't supposed to taste like fruit. Pussy almond milk. To, pussy has a distinct taste and it's supposed to taste like that. pussy. Exactly. It's supposed to taste like pussy. Delicious. Is is is. So you think pussy tastes delicious? I love that. You can find some authentic. It's pussy. sweet, but it's it's strong. Yeah. It's strong. It's it's yeah. It's got a little. You know it's what? a little funk. It, it taste. It smell fresh. But, but it also depends on what she eat. That, 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 that could like be a, true. It's like Fast a seafood food pussy fruit. probably don't taste good. Black and mild pussy. Uh, it's like a seafood fruit. <laughs> Salad. A seafood fruit. <laughs> What you mean a seafood? A seafood With fruit? A little yogurt. <laughs> like if they grew like pineapples it's got in the, the tartness of a yogurt. <laughs> no, the, the hint. It, yeah, the, the hint, hint the of hint, yogurt. The hint of but yogurt. What's the seafood? What seafood right you here. talking about? Yeah. Mussels? No, I'm mm. just saying maybe like a. You've been eating pussy a, for a, too a, long. A scallop. Like a chalet, a, a scallop, a light, a light seafood flavor. Something real light, something very. This need to stop right now. Buttery. This is crazy. In texture. Buttery. Buttery in texture. Maybe, in texture. Maybe like a, <laughs> maybe like a tartar of sorts. Oh my gosh, this shit funny as hell. <laughs> yeah, because I'm leaning towards something more like it's a faint. Not a ceviche. No, not a ceviche. That's, that's, that's a ceviche. That's too much. That's what they cook it in Lyme juice. It kind of tastes like it's been poached. Hollandaise. And, and brought up to a slow broil. But then it was like, it was marinated overnight. Oh, it's been simmering. Right, and then... That's it, right when you want it. Right, right when it starts to simmer. And then it's simmer. complemented with the consistency of a creme brulee. With a hint <laughs> of nutmeg. Just a slight undertone of cinnamon, and you can definitely taste the sea salt. Yeah, mm -hmm. yes. I think so too. Yeah. Just a slight undertone of nutmeg and a yeah. tad bit of sea salt. Just a little Just yes. pinch. Yeah. Yes. Make you do that. Cause that's that thong that been up in that ass. Is it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. That, that sea salt come from that thong up in that ass. <laughs> Word. But that nutmeg. Rosemary, cinnamon. That's what you be doing? Mm-hmm. Yeah, people be buying my thongs for 2500 sometimes. You've sold your drawers mm -hmm. for 25 I take them right off my ass, straight off my ass. What? You gonna sell 2500 Straight off draws? my ass. They don't want me to wash <clears throat> them at all. They just take it straight off my ass. Are you just send it in the regular mail? Yep. You supposed to fail. You supposed Priority. to. Yeah, Priority. I was about to say, you Priority. can't be having. That shit <laughs> can't be in the mail for seven, eight days. Yeah, now. you know God what? You're getting real funny right now. <laughs> no, I'm just, I'm, I'm saying in draw. the past, people have bought thongs off my ass. <laughs> but I'm saying you, you should have made this a business. Like, you don't do this on the regular? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. At request. It's like a request. I don't need to thing. do that no more. Just now, I just suffocate niggas. Why you got, and why? then you know they like my toes too. They like these toes. Yeah, you know I like to keep them done. This this right here, this little pedicure costs like eighty five dollars. This is real cheap. Mm -hmm. That's decent. Yeah, it's decent. That's decent. Yeah, that's yeah. something that you need to start helping bitches pay for their feet and stuff. 
Yeah. Why, why are you getting this? I'm just saying because I already know you said you Who don't. Who helped like... you pay for these? I, I pay for because I'm rich, so oh, I pay really? for myself. But just because I'm independent don't mean I don't need no nigga. Yeah, damn. Cause you you see how these to these toes pretty? You to Did you like my toes? Do you like my toes? Eighty five dollars yeah, for the toe? They just for that foot? Or is that perfect? No, for foot? both feet. Oh. I know. Look, foot. look at my feet. I keep them done. Yeah, yeah, they good. But eighty five. Nice feet. Because she on the eighty five south show. Nice. Oh, eighty five south. Nice yeah. feet. Thank you. See, niggas you love my feet. We're bad. I see that. They always say cause I got long toes so I can pick stuff up cause you know I mix so we pick stuff up with our with our feet. What you mix with? Wait I'm a minute. gonna who, tell you, but we like to pick say, stuff what, up with what, our feet. Who picks stuff up with and I don't pick stuff up and feed so myself. You, what what mix with <laughs> I mix with black and African. Let's black and African. Oh, you African. It's the same thing. Exactly. So I like to I pick stuff you, up though, with my feet I'm... and feed niggas. That's what I like to do. I'm gonna cook for you and I'm gonna feed. Niggas. What happened? Hmm? <laughs> He's so aggressive towards niggas. I don't think I'm aggressive. Cause you be like these niggas. It be so hard. Cause it's like, what do I call? What do I call them? Man. Oh, and I love a real manly man, like real manly, yeah, that man. don't play that shit. Yeah, yeah. He don't like to do all that. I ain't eating out your feet. That's that's the type of nigga. No, 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 no. Always trying to feed me tortilla chips with your feet. Fuck that. No, I'm just playing. No, not that man. Not that man. He gonna tell you what kind of man he ain't. No, yeah, hey, but hey, I'm hey, not talking about that type nigga. of man. Don't be putting your feet on in the goddamn grapes and shit, man. What so y'all don't like this shit, man? All that feet shit. Hey, I'm from the country. You Keep your goddamn shoes Y'all don't like to lick feet. toes. Toes. Y'all don't lick toes. Um. Nah, I can't say that I'm. Then lick some toes before. I can't say I don't. Sometimes the motherfuckers look so good and be so smooth. You exactly, gotta, I'm gonna you say. You be on some freaky shit. It's just the ass. It's like, I don't know. Exactly. You just do Why wouldn't shit. you lick toes? Y'all don't lick toes. I he got his tongue out. So y'all don't lick toes in the crowd? <laughs> <laughs> Please. Y'all don't lick toes? <laughs> who? Who had it? Him? Luke had it. He freaky. <laughs> who did it? I yeah. him right yeah. there in the, in the, in the tent. Yeah. He did it. Yeah, he had over here talking about He do shit like Who that. Who licked toes? <laughs> Who licked toes? Every, every grown man in here didn't lick some toes before. Y'all don't no lick toes? That shit regular. It's, it is regular, but everybody saying they don't do it, but you. I said that. I was the first nigga that said, no yeah, man. I licked like some toes. I I'm telling you, I have dealt with some women with some beautiful ass feet. That's I'm what I'm saying. About, feet are pretty. I know a motherfucker got the prettiest feet. For in real? The world. Yes, and I hope she's doing well. I told the bitch go put your shoes on. Sometimes a motherfucker be so fat. You both butt naked. I said, go wish, put them in for us. You just wish what them all the, the best. Fuck? <laughs>
We gave this away for free for years. Let's move together. Why would you let somebody come year. invest in the show and put it on another network and you're buying their subscription? You don't ask them why you're buying their shit. So don't ask us. We're putting it on the app. Who's over the app? Nobody knows. Get the app. Yeah. We saw what you said in the comments. We, sure did. we saw it. We saw everybody. The good, the we bad. Got somebody to read every fucking comment. And the ugly. We'll so you know what? We folding under this pressure. Sure did. We hear you. We heard you. We hear you. We went and did. We'll that's just get the fuck on at y'all way. Yep. Just for an hour though. Yep. That's yep. all you get is an hour. So don't you can't complain. Well, where the rest of it? I at? think they should get 37 minutes. Oh, see, we got to hurry up. we should up. put a whole bunch of ads in between, like long ass ads, like five minute ads. Hey, how you doing? Uh, you <laughs> Slow motion ads. Slow, slow it down. Waste a motherfucking time. Yeah, uh, let's just uh, go ahead and make sure. Channel85.com. I want to make sure I read what they wrote. They wrote some shit out for us. These niggas don't know how to spell or type proper sentences, but they trying get to get us to get y'all to buy the app. What, you think we want to read this shit? Channel 85, man. So we can talk that shit, man. Ladies, don't you like the deep thrust, huh? Go get it on the app. That's right. On the app. Uncensored, unfiltered, and edited. Can you believe that? I'm talking about with actual production in it. Jump cuts, yep. clips. All types of types of like exclusive shit that they don't even know that we did. They don't even know that we got a show where we be cooking like exotic foods and shit. Okay. That's on the app. Sports show. Yep. Talk show, documentary. Chico got a handwriting class that he teach. <laughs> Nobody passed it. Cause Nobody. that's why the shit look like right. this. But we're working on it, and you can see it on the app. It's they didn't, the e- app. didn't even tell them about the tax course that we had uploaded on there. No cap. They don't even know that we, we got we a whole show about Wall Street. And the $5,000 on the app. Right. <laughs> and we got the alternate ending to the color purple up there. Oh, right. man. No cap. We got the raw edition, all the uncut, all the bloopers. We got all that. Right. It's on the app. So if you want to see some shit that, you know, they trying to hide from you, Go to that. I'm leaving though. Channel85.com. Go get the app. You got an hour for free. We gave you what you wanted. Now give us some subscriptions to the app. $8.50, $8.99 with tax, $85 a year. Channel85.com, 85 South Show. Get the app. Well, see, this is what they don't know. The app really $3, but adjusted for inflation is $8.99. Yeah. What Low said. Get the app, man. Stop bullshitting. We out of here, man. We're not about to keep working all this time for. We are going on out, baby. We are going on out. We on your way to fly. On air.